Okay, this is that new antenna. I just came in, decided I would check it out, see if there was anything different about it. Um, this is the same distance it was last time uh, in our earlier video, a long time ago. Uh, and all I've changed is this antenna, the receiver antenna, and it actually does seem to be more stable. Uh, with this antenna, which uh, is actually a pretty nice antenna. It's pretty much well standard stuff, though. Uh, you would get a little bit of static because I've got it in the uh, kitchen area, which is going through a lot of interference. So the next thing I'm going to do, besides show y'all what all this is going through, uh, that up there is duct work. And of course, we're going through all this. That's concrete. That's concrete. Wow, I can't really see it. So, concrete, metal, wiring. Uh, and this is where it's at. And I've got an old standard little mushroom antenna on it right now. So, let me change it now and see if it makes a difference. Okay, so now I've changed it. I put this one on now. So now we will plug it in and check it out. So here we go. It is a pretty cool looking antenna. I'll give it that. Now we see a difference. So it works better as a receiving antenna than it does a transmitting antenna. That's, yeah, that's, that's, that's a big difference. Okay, let's switch back to the other one. So now we're back to the original, the original antennas all together. So this is what the screen looks like. You see the lines in it. It's just a, a tiny bit off from the other. And we do our little hand over it test. And it does just like the other. So it, it's really no different. So. I would say it's not worth the extra money. Sorry, guy. But just thought you might want to see. This is where it came from. It, it was a guy on eBay. And um, it was, he described it as being better than your regular circle antenna. And of course, there's the guy. I will say that. He did package it really nicely. He put it in this cute little box, and they were all wrapped up, and there's even some of that little fuzzy stuff. And he had uh, each one individually wrapped with bubble wrap, and had a little bit of paper in there too. So he wrapped it good, but it's, it's really, it's no better than the regular ones, to tell you the truth. And you can get the other regular ones for much, much, much cheaper. In fact, as I'll show you, as you can see here, yes, the price is twenty-five, thirty-five with free shipping, but we have three sets, so that is six total antennas: three transmit, three receive. So the price is much, much, much cheaper, and these are every bit as good as his $17 ones. And they look nice as well. Here's what they look like. They don't come in such a fancy little pack though. And that's what you're looking at right there. We'll pop one out for you. This is why I do this stuff. That way you don't have to go through what I've gone through. But uh, 
this is the uh, received very nicely made everything is exact there are no mistakes in this very nicely done as you can see on this one it is a little wop-sided that could have been from shipping but if you look right here that one is down further than all the rest and on this one this one is definitely not the same all the way around so these cheaper ones are actually better that's where they get their clover leaf thing uh, by the way um, so much better cheaper too so hope this helps you out and uh, just so you know in case you want to get those yourself it is of course FPV Cloverleaf Omnidirectional and here is the seller and uh, that is a lot of reviews to have a 99.9 .9. good seller so there you go